Good morning, happy Monday. Just making some tea real quick, some black tea, and it's not the black tea that I wanted. They didn't drunk up my Tezo black tea, so I gotta settle for this black tea, which is it's fine, but the other one tastes a little better. I just like Tezo's brand. And then I told y'all about this wild sweet orange. Oh my goodness, that smells so good. Intermittent fasting has been going well. For the last couple days, I've been eating only like one meal a day. And I'm not doing that really on purpose. It's just, oh, this is way too much. Stop, stop, stop. Oh, I'm gonna just have to let it drip. Cause I forgot, I put it on 12 ounces and I forgot this is only probably like 10 ounces. Sometimes I don't even eat until like two o'clock. And like I said, I'm not doing that on purpose. You know, it just depends on, you know, what I'm doing if I'm busy. Set this down, let that cool off. If I haven't been just craving a lot of stuff and just wanting to eat for no reason, I probably mentioned it in a vlog. I know I have. Like I would come on here and tell y'all I don't know what's wrong with me, but I've just been eating any and everything. Yeah, that was going on for like a couple months. I don't get those urges or that feeling anymore. I'm glad that's gone. Oh, let me take my vitamins real quick. I am shipping out orders i've still got the last few orders to ship out now on my website i do have it right there at the top that the current processing time is five to six business days thank you for your patience i promise you you will get your products no scamming over here you would get your products so we about to head to the florida mall cleveland didn't get nearly as much stuff as I got and look, we went for him. But that was to be expected and that's how it goes sometimes, right? But um, he found a few pair of pants, a couple of shirts that he wanted, like casual shirts and what? Ooh, excuse me. Well, now he decided to go to the Florida Mall, which I told his butt he should have went there yesterday because the Florida Mall has way more options, a lot more stores. As you can see, he has a hard time trying to find uh, clothes <laughs> in his size. I think he's just looking for like some casual shoes right now. He did see some in Aldo. Of course, they didn't have his size. So, so yeah, I do have on the H&M hoodie that i purchased yesterday this fits great it's a size extra large so i didn't try on any of the clothes that i purchased that was like in a size small and medium i'm trying to try that stuff on today but yeah it fits so good i love it i'm actually thinking about going back to get another maybe not maybe not i'm not going I, I got too many black hoodies already so but this one is definitely one of my favorites and let me show y'all what i got on real quick she gonna move can you move, ma'am? Ma'am? Can you move out the way? <laughs> move, Janelle. Move out the way. You're in front of the mirror. <laughs> Y'all, my hair is just like it was yesterday. Just like I left it when I got out of the bed this morning. I ain't even spray it this morning. I'm going to spray it a little bit because it's getting a little crusty. The same earrings from yesterday, same necklace from yesterday, the hoodie, got on my MCM bag, and these are the um, uh, Reebok <laughs> leggings that I picked up on clearance for $12 at Marshalls, and they fit so good. I love the material. It's like this, like, I don't know, it's like silky material. It has pockets. If we go to another Marshalls today, I'm going to see if they have more because I just love leggings. Well, I'm pretty sure we all love leggings that fits right, it's comfortable, and these definitely does the job. And for $12, <laughs> yes. And then I just threw on, it's cold, but I didn't want to wear any shoes today. I wanted to wear my Gucci slides. These are one of my favorite slides. Most comfortable, definitely worth the price in my opinion. These are so comfortable. These have gotten a lot of wear. These are my most worn slides. Yeah, I got on the black socks that I purchased from H&M. And this is how we're rolling today. Nice and comfortable. So me. <laughs> Backwards, yeah. And much your lover who don't use big words. Now, why y'all didn't tell me that y'all sent me some gifts for Christmas? 
Cleveland went to the P.O. Box a couple days ago and pulled out all of these gifts. And I do know one person who messaged me and told me that she had sent me something. I think it was her mother made me something or something like that. But the rest of y'all didn't tell me that y'all sent me cards. Like I don't be checking my P.O. Box like that. Especially when I'm not shipping packages. There's one right here. And she says, open on camera. Who is this? Ashanti. Oh, these are cute. These look like these little cute earrings that Naya likes to wear. Oh, she's so freaking beautiful. Hey, Ashanti girl. I got a little letter here, the butterfly on it. I don't, I don't have time, so I shouldn't even start this right now. I don't have time. Hello, my name is Ashanti. I'm 19 years old. I've been watching your videos for so long. You are literally my favorite YouTuber. I've been watching your videos since you lived in Ohio. When I'm bored, I love I love watching your old videos. I even catch my boyfriend looking over my shoulders watching your videos too. You make me so happy even on my bad days. I've had a lot of bad days lately, but watching you and your family makes me smile so much. You guys are so goofy. I love it. You were actually part of what inspired me to start my own YouTube channel called Ashanti Smiles. Go check Ashanti Smiles out, y'all. It makes me so happy to film, but my channel isn't doing so well, so I was wondering if you can go check out my channel. It would mean so much to me. I know my quality isn't that good because my money being tight, I can only film on my iPhone, but I gotta start somewhere. That's exactly right. Where I live, there's a lot of jealousy that goes around, so kids my age don't really support me because they don't like seeing you do good for yourself. That's everywhere. <laughs> like I have a small business, like I have a small business, for example, on Instagram, and I haven't been active on there lately since I'm always working, but no one in my town buys for me because I was never the popular type in school, more of the quiet one. Um, but enough of the side story. Please check out my channel and tell Naya she should become more active on her channel too because I love watching her. I lo also love watching Deja and Yana too. I love their style. But anyways, girl, keep up the good work. I love you. Oh yeah, and here's some lip gloss and some things I hope I made. I hope you enjoy. I made them myself and maybe the girls will like my jewelry. I think Naya would like the lip gloss because she likes wearing lip gloss and when I get my money right, I would definitely be buying some of your body butters. They look so cute and they look like they smell so good. But anyways, thank you for making me smile and I hope you will enjoy. Well, Ashanti, I'm gonna actually send you some body butters. I got your address, don't I? Yep, sure enough. I got your address and I will be sending you some body butters. So don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about buying it. But yeah, these are so cute. Naya's gonna love these. Look at these. So cute. She's definitely gonna love these. And then, oh, this is like a keychain. Well, I might keep this one. <laughs> That's cute. Then we got some lip gloss. We got a clear raspberry and strawberry. And they got some cute little glitter in them. And we got some other little jewelry here. Um, that. And some more earrings. You didn't leave no business card or anything like that, honey. I need to know your Instagram. Like, where can we buy your products from? This is from... Um, ba, 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 ba. Nita, my girl Nita. Hey, I see Mickey. Nita. Thank you, girl. Oh, these are too cute. Thank you so much. She said, hey sis, this is Anita BR Designs. I just wanted to give you a gift because I know you love Mickey. You always cooking those tasty meals and I can see you using these love you and the family nita thank you so much oh nita got a website hustle diva okay i will be over i will go over there and check you out yeah hustle diva and we got a gift from tamia it's pretty fancy okay tamia tamia what's up with all the tape now look at this like why did you take girl i see mickey i see mickey these things around here always talk about they don't know what to get me how come y'all know just anything Mickey? I mean, I, you can't go wrong with anything Mickey. <laughs> these are so cute, even though I already have these, but I can use them somewhere else as decoration. <laughs> I think these are the salt and pepper shakers. Thank you so much for thinking of me, Tamia. Oh, this is 
cute. And then, uh-oh, there's something in here. Oh, it's a, a mug. Got the letter J on it. And this candle smells so good. Citrus Sunset. Mmm, that smells really good. Thank you so much. She didn't leave no kind of... Oh, I know she did. She left a card. She wrote a lot. She said, read on camera. I have so many similarities with Naya from clothing size to looks. And she put her Robux uh, username. Um, it's Tamia. I don't know if she want me to put her Roblox username here for the world to see, but I would show enough give Naya your Roblox uh, username. You brighten my world with your sweet spirit. Bring joy to those around you. Hi, Javon, Auntie. I just wanted to let you know your family. Your family is my favorite YouTube fam. Uh, you remind me of my family. We never miss a vlog. I wish I could send you something. I wish I could send something for everyone, but I literally wanted to do something special for you and Naya, especially because I really enjoy your mommy daughter day vlog. It remind me of my mom and I. Naya, I hope you like this scented candle and your mug. Okay, so the mug was for Naya. Okay, the salt and pepper shaker is for Auntie Tamia. Tamia is 11 years old. Homegirl left her number and where she lived, but I ain't gonna share that with y'all. But Tamia, thank you so much, girl. That is so sweet. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I will be sure to give Naya the candle and the coffee mug. God bless you, sweetie. Got another gift right here that's all fancy and wrapped up. This is from Ethel. Hey, Ethel, girl. My bad, Miss Ethel. <laughs> Miss Ethel. So pretty. Oh, you would definitely be using this next year. This is freaking beautiful. And she made this. She actually took the time out and made this, make this for me. So I gotta get a special box or a bin just for that. Okay, and then here's the card. Merry Christmas. Enjoy this personalized gift. Give Just Because by Prosperity Gifts to Javon and family from Ethel. And then she lists her daughter's and da granddaughter name. I don't want to butcher it, but this is my good sis who's always messaging me and commenting. But um, her name is Zabria Zatora. Zatora. Z Zatoria. Sorry, and that's her granddaughter. She said, I recently moved from Arkansas to Virginia with my daughter and granddaughter. I enjoy watching your vlogs. I have been in business since the 90s and I enjoy making people, people smile. I love Ethel, I wish you would have left your website. Email me your website or wherever you sell your gifts from so I can go over there and check it out. So this is the last package. I did receive about seven cards. <laughs> I'm so sorry, y'all. I am so, so late. We about to be in February. But this one is from Kamatha. We got a book, My Voice, His Lead, Encouraging Moments Devotional Series by Kamatha. Kamatha Martin. Let's go right here. Hi, Javon. I don't know how I stumbled across your channel, but I love your content. Because of you, I have been taking a liking to Crocs and crossbody purses. I wanted to bless you with one of my newly released 60-day devotional, which is now available for purchase on Amazon. I pray it is a blessing to you. I know that you are a believer, and I do hope you find encouragement in my devotional and feel free to share. So her devotional is available on Amazon. The name of the book is My Voice, His Lead, and yeah, it's just that, a uh, devotional. Okay, so I'm going to read a page or two out of her devotional. Devotional. So Matthew 7, 12 says, whatever you want men to do to you, do also to them. In a world where it seems love has become scarce and kindness is rare, one of the most fulfilling things is to impact someone's life for the better. You don't have to do anything great, but a kind or encouraging word can go a long way. And that it does, because I appreciate y'all in the comments. It does not go unnoticed. I see y'all. Y'all, the comments definitely helps me. Think about how it makes you feel when someone takes the time to show you that they care. 
everyone wants to feel loved and in this sometimes cold world shoot sometimes this is see, like all the time we can all make a difference by giving what we want to receive in return no matter how independent people may seem we need each other because we are created to have a community beloved what are you doing to make your corner of the world just a little bit brighter how do you stay above the negativity to truly be a blessing and to be blessed go against the grain go against the grain show love forgive be kind go the extra mile give what you want to receive it costs nothing to extend to others what god so freely gives to us amen okay i got some cards here from well this is not a card this is like a letter or something from al fashion company i'm not gonna read it or read all of the cards <laughs> please read on camera hey auntie von lol i've been calling you that she said my name is markeisha jones um i inspired her to start her business in october of last year i was so excited but shortly after i started i realized i wasn't getting any sales so, so far i got six and i'm so grateful for but i'm feeling a bit discouraged i don't know what to do next so if you don't mind so if you don't mind please share my story with your supporters i've included a ten dollars off discount code which is your vlogs i'll keep you updated on my business journey for everything thank you for everything that you do and continue to succeed lots of love you included a discount code but i mean there's no website no instagram no nothing oh wait wait my bad let me shut up let me shut up it was it, it was a business card in here okay so her website is al fashion company and instagram oh i feel stupid right now <laughs> Okay, so this is her information. And I know it can be discouraging. You was all happy that, you know, starting your own business and you didn't get the sales, the, uh, the well, the amount of sales that you wanted. But all I can say is, honey, keep going. Keep going. Keep doing any and everything that you can to get your business out there. And quitting is not going to get you anywhere, right? Just keep pushing. Keep pushing. I tell y'all this all the time. I probably would be in the same boat because, honey, if it was not for y'all, my supporters, my family, for if it wasn't for y'all, <laughs> my business would probably be <laughs> as well. But just keep going, honey. And I'm going to go over and check out your website. Okay, the last one is from London. And, uh-oh, she sent a picture. And she wrote wrote a lot. A lot. Hey, London girl. And she's she beautiful. Okay, honey, I do not have time to read all of this, but then I feel bad that I don't read all this because I read everybody else's, so we're going to do it. Cleo, just going to have to wait. Hello. So, first off, I don't speak Spanish. Oh, okay. So, I didn't even pay no attention that all of the words were in Spanish. Okay. So, I was wondering why she was telling me that she didn't speak Spanish. She said, hello, my name is London, and I'm from Youngstown, Ohio, and I just turned 21 on the 6th. I have been watching your videos for years. I started watching my freshman year of high school and I'm now 21 in my third year of college. Your family brings me so much joy on days I don't want to continue on. Your videos brighten my day. You are an angel in my life and I'm so blessed to have you in it. I am also a 10 year cancer survivor. I was diagnosed in 2010 after my ninth birthday. There were days when all I wanted to do was give up, but God pushed and encouraged me through it. I still I still have he I still have health issues and your videos helped me through them. Before surgeries or procedures, I watch them for comfort. Thank you for it all. I will continue to write and hope to get your response from you one day. Merry Christmas from London. I'm, I'm lost for words, London. I mean, I, first off, I am so happy that you beat cancer. I know you said you're still going through some health issues. I pray in Jesus' name that he heals you from all of the issues that you're going through. I'm happy my videos was able to brighten your day, but 
I gotta give all the glory to God. Uh, I gotta give it all to him. I received so many messages like that and still to this day, it's like not overwhelming, but it's just like, wow, little old me. And I say little old me, not to belittle myself, I'm not saying that I'm just nobody. I'm just saying, it's just, I, over the years that I've been on YouTube, Y'all have told me I have made such an impact on your life. I brighten your day. I even received, I even received messages from people who wanted to commit suicide, and my videos made them think we're not go through with it. And y'all just don't understand. It's just like I, I still to this day. It's just like what me? Like I said. All glory to God. But thank you so much, London, for sharing that with me. I will be praying for you, honey. Okay, I'm in Zara. I like these pants, but they don't got my size. You know, all they got is small, so love. They do got a whole like, sale section over here. Cleveland in the men's section somewhere. Dresses, $12.99. Shirts, $12.99. More shirts, pants. These green pants are so pretty. I got some green heels. I know that green color is kind of in because it's like that, what, a Bottega green or something like that. I've <laughs> been hearing people talking about. I really like these pants. I can't describe the material, but it's not jean material. I don't even know how to describe them, but they're cute. The biggest size they got is a size 12. I, I can't even. Slim fit, high rise, crop leg. It's, it does have a little bit of flair to it. Mm. They also have it in, in the brown. I like the brown even better. If they had them in my size, I would get both pairs. But biggest size they have is a 12 so I might have to look online so I'm in H&M remember these ribbed leggings that I purchased in a size medium so they have a size large here so I'm gonna go ahead and get them just in case those size the medium doesn't fit I'm probably what depending on how they fit and look I might keep the mediums because your girl will go get down to a size medium one day I'm not buying any more jackets sweatshirts or sweaters because I already have a lot of them. I am not one of those people that wears a hoodie in 80 degree weather <laughs> like some of these kids do. Mine's included. Well they don't anymore but when we first moved here they, Jay especially, would wear a hoodie and it'd be 80, 90 degrees outside. Let me get some more of these socks because they're so comfortable and see they're not all dingy. Because Nike socks, remember I was about to like buy a pack of Nike socks for $22 and the most was dingy. I'm going to just do it. And this Aldo got a better selection. This purse is really pretty. Y'all have to see it in person. This is really pretty. This one is um, $115 and this one is $135. Black. Let's see. These I was telling y'all that they had them in different colors. I got them in all little colors here. I like these sunglasses, but I don't like all of that on the side. That's a little bit too much for me. What a dog collar that I got for Chanel on sale for $12.98 now. I paid $25 for it. These are different ones that they have. Big dog. They got them in your size? <laughs> I'm about to see because when I tried a 13 on yesterday, it was kind of. The 13 was too big? Just a, yeah, like in the toe part, you know, because they're kind of long. So gotcha, gotcha, yeah. I'm going to see if I can fit a 12. And then... that, that one, I had to put an insole in it. Like this. It's a shoe pair. Boxes in there. So 
Auntie Anne's then lured us in with the smell of the cinnamon and sugar and dough. Cause that be smelling good too. So we just gonna share uh, cinnamon and sugar. Alright, here's the receipt down on the app to get reward points. Thank you. Well, I only shop every once in a while. I go like a whole year and just get like little t-shirts and little joggers and stuff. So I, I hardly ever go shopping. It's always her going shopping. So this is like a first. That. They know that. Yeah. And oh, I told yeah. them that. I told them that. Uh, I think I did. I think I told them that you go shopping maybe once or twice a year. Once or twice a year, yeah. <laughs> so most of the time when you do, because when we go out shopping together, you see stuff that just don't have your size. So that be, yo, that's a big yeah. limitation too. Because yeah. you, I think you would have a lot more stuff if they would have your size. Like, they got the size as far as the, my waist size. They never have my length. Yeah. It's always stopping at 30 or 32. So, it's strong. Do you want to go back in Old Navy? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. So am. I'm about to get both of these. Quite a shake. Mm -hmm. To shake some of that excess, excess cinnamon and sugar off. I think I'm gonna get these joggers. They have these are men's. It's a medium. I guess I can fit them. I don't know. I think I might need to get that large. Like this color and this color. They got this color, that color. I already got a couple in this color and I got a couple in black already. So we in Dillard's and they got a lot of um, Louis Vuitton, hello, Louis Vuitton purses over here. This right here, they got a selfie, selfie world. Take all kind of little selfies. They got like little booths and stuff like that where you can take selfies. It's pretty cool. I seen it on the news a while ago. What's this Mr. Puffs? Dessert bar. We was looking at this place right here, this Katina Katrina, but I don't know. Oh yeah, and they reviews kind of suck. They <laughs> said they barely give you any food and it has no flavor, and that's a big problem for me, the flavor. Now look at the sprinklers. They jacking up, well they ain't messing up the car, but it's all on that car. And then uh, look over here. And then look at this one. The way I got y'all sitting up here, so ghetto, so ghetto. Okay, so we at Yardbird. We was gonna go or try Uncle Julio's, but I don't know. I didn't feel like eating no Mexican food right now. She never does. <laughs> She, she'll go because I want to go, and then I gotta hear about it the whole time we eat it. And, uh, yeah, cause uh, she control where we eat basically. Cause sometimes they it don't be having no flavor. Like the places we go to, they don't be having no flavor, and I'm all with the flavor and the seasoning. Okay, I know we're gonna get good food, good flavor, good customer service. So, um, it sucks. What? It sucks. Happy hour ain't until three. It's only two. So I can't get my um, Wisconsin cheese curds for half off. Which is take water. Two water? Yeah. Um, are you ready to order? Yeah. Okay. I'll take the cheese curds. Yeah. For an appetizer? Yeah. Right. And I'll take the um, Cobb salad with salmon. With salmon? Do you want to do the half or full size salad? It's like a lunch or a dinner portion. Not a lunch. Lunch? Salad, chicken, or I'm sorry, salmon. Yeah. Uh, everything on is okay? Yeah. Oh, no bacon. No bacon. Yeah. There's like 400 things on that salad. <laughs> For you? Um, whiskey glazed salmon. And the whiskey glazed salmon? This is the playoff for these conference champs. Yeah. Whoever wins needs the winner of each of these to go to the Super Bowl. Getting light inside in there. No, but their quarterback is. So I'm saying they always be the Lions. Because he was on the Lions, he went to the Rams. Now that he in, he's out here now. He in the, uh, if they beat them, then they go into the Super Bowl. He might win the Super Bowl. He got a chance. They just beat Tom Brady. It's a little hot. Thank you. You're welcome. Enjoy. 
Because you know Michael Jackson did this, too. Yeah. So is this the original or he copying up from Michael Jackson? Yeah. I need to copy her, too. Who needs to see? Cause I wouldn't mind doing like a Jackson show over here, watching this. Yeah. Or one of the circus. Did we do one? Circus Soleil. Did we do one? Somebody was flipping mine. I was in Michael Jackson thing. Oh, it was like Michael Jackson. Oh, okay. Kind of spicy. Yeah. It was in a fire. Whatever that word was good. It was an onion. Yeah. Oh, I want to see it. What? Alright, not tomorrow, because I ain't tomorrow. I ain't say tomorrow. Oh, I forgot I was recording over there. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Is it at the bottom? Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, make it. Uh, 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 uh. 
I like sauces of all kinds, to be honest. Like, I will take any sauce to go. <laughs> Y'all have a great afternoon. Thank you. Our next restaurant to try is the Sloppy Joe's. Right here, this is newer. They got the Florida Keys uh, buoy thing or whatever you call this thing out here. But they make it look pretty good. If I would have paid attention, I would have ate here before we ate at the yard house. Of course, that's the Asian talk about them out here. All right, we about to head on back home. Okay, about to run in this. Whole Foods to see if they have any of my ice cream sandwiches. The last time we were here, they didn't have any. They got a couple left and they not on sale. Darn it. Last time I got them, they was on sale for two dollars and something. It looked like they only got two. So I'm about to grab these two. And Deja and I get one. Oh, they got some up there. But we were in here last week and they had not one. I was so mad. So the calories for one sandwich is 170. And this is the ingredients. I was about to say Monday. Today is Tuesday. I just did an hour on the treadmill and I feel good. How y'all doing? I hope everyone is well, feeling good, looking good, and all of that good stuff. It is 1.34. I haven't ate anything, just drunk some water. I didn't even have no tea today. Naya made a smoothie this morning and she asked me if I wanted some, so I just got a little bit. It was probably maybe like four ounces of it. So I ain't about to cook nothing, cook nothing. I'm just about to throw this pot pie in the microwave. This is what we working with. Amy's broccoli pot pie, so good. I just threw my pot pie in the microwave, but I'm about to record a shoe haul. I got all of these boxes, but not this box here because I'm taking those back. Like, I'll show y'all what they look like in a minute, but those are going back because I do not like them. I want to give away this bag here. The Bloomingdale's medium brown bag. I had this for about a year now. <laughs> Girl, I don't even know why I bought it. But yeah, I have never used it before. Obviously, this is the medium brown bag. You don't have to do anything special. You don't have to have Instagram. You don't have to say, I want the bag or anything like that. Just comment like you would normally comment. So as you can see, your girl been shopping for shoes and I'm not even, oh well, all of my stuff is not even here yet. I got some Burberry. A little bit of luxury, a little bit of black girl luxury going on over here. Um, Doshi and Gabbana, Alexander McQueen, and no, these are not the shoes. These are some slides. <laughs> I got these mugs on sale and I love them. Now, I wish I would have thought to do an unboxing, especially on the Doshi and Gabbana. I wish I would have unboxed them with y'all. Like I said, these are some slides and I got these on Bloomingdale's website. Y'all know I love me some Bloomingdale's. I'm gonna do a whole separate video on all of my shoes and I'm gonna be trying them on so you can see what they look like on foot and I'm gonna be giving a, away a pair of shoes as well so make sure y'all check out that channel um not that channel <laughs> that video I honestly want to do a luxury wish list video and I might still do it I, I just want to venture out and do other types of videos instead of just vlogs not making another channel for it. I'm put it right here on this channel, you know, just to have fun. You know what I'm saying? And I am going to be doing um, or start doing meal planning. So I want to do a whole separate video, you know, not in a vlog. I just want to do a separate video on meal planning, cooking the meals, all of that stuff. Y'all, they got some coach slides on sale for $33. This is what they look like. And they got them in, well, most of the sizes are gone, but they got them in silver. Uh, what is this? Uh, buttercup, which is yellow. I uh, guess this nude color and a dark red, or what they call them, candy apple red. So they got, they got a lot of sizes left in the red. The nude, they got sizes left. This is eight up though. <laughs> 
and I think this one was eight up. Yeah. Over on Instagram, I've been doing some reels. So that's what I'm gonna do. When I catch some sales, I'm gonna pass it on to you guys, either through a reel or on my community tab because I mean, I can tell y'all in the vlog, but who knows when the vlog would come out and some of these sales, some of these deals, you need to jump on it. And make sure you have your notifications turned on for this channel because I think it alerts you when I post something to my community tab. And they got some Balenciaga sides. They only got this color, this gray, uh, for $110. And they got all sizes left. And they also got these Balenciagas on sale i think the purple ones yeah the purple ones on sale for 91 dollars, y'all these lilac I, I think the green oh they got the oh the green is regular price so 91 325. now i'm gonna pass on all of these slides but i thought i'll share them with you guys i know some of y'all like <laughs> paying on $91 for no slides but you into the luxury or starting to get into luxury $91 is a good deal. Hey y'all, miss these. I would have grabbed these for $35. Some Ugg slippers. All the mugs is gone. <laughs> they ate the mugs up. $35 for some Ugg slippers. And now these is in the men section. I would be able to fit the size seven. Dang, I was too late for this one. They got the Balenciagas in the black and white and the men's on sale for $280, it's not $91, but it's regular $350. Okay, this is the last one. This is on Neiman's, Neiman Marcus website. It's the Alexander McQueen slides, and they are on sale for $117. That's even better than what I paid for mine. I got the blue ones, and I can tell you they are definitely comfortable. I've worn around the house to get a feel for them. Now, I did get mines in women's and I did go up a half size. So I did get a nine and a half and they fit perfectly. If you got a bigger feet and you can fit these sizes in men's or for your husband. You know what? I might grab Cleveland up here. They don't have his size. Turn it. It's taking every bit of me to pass on these. I'm gonna pass on them. But don't be surprised if y'all see me doing an unboxing on these <laughs> in the next week or so. But for now, I'm going to pass on them. But I'm seriously thinking about snatching them up for $117. Especially because I know how comfortable they are. Hmm. A few minutes later. So why did I order the slides? <laughs> I couldn't pass that up. I, I don't care. Judge me if you want to. I'm going to show y'all the ones I ordered off of Bloomingdale's. Got them on sale for $170. So this is what they look like. Beautiful blue color. And like I said, they're so comfortable. And sometimes with slides, I have a problem with this part here rubbing up against my toes. It's rubber but it's nice and soft and it's not too tight on my feet. Like I said, these are just perfect. And I don't know if y'all can tell, but the way the sole is like made, it's kind of like an indention right here. It's like made to conform to the, the shape of your foot. I don't know if I'm explaining that right, but it's not just flat. It got little indentions for your toes to go to fit comfortably. That says made in Italy. Oh, y'all wanna see what they look like on? Let me show y'all what they look like on foot. Cause I know when I watch uh, shoe videos, I be wanting to see what it look like on foot. So when I do my shoe haul, I'm gonna try on all the shoes for y'all so y'all can see what they look like. So real quick, let me show y'all what the um, shoes that, or sandals look like that I'm taking back. I got them from Nordstrom's. And I could just go to Nordstrom Rack and return these, cause I was just gonna mail it in. Yeah, I'm gonna just take these to Nordstrom Rack. The brand is Arizona Love. Never heard of this brand before. I just thought the shoes look cute. I think they retail, Mm, I forgot what they retail, but they retail too much. I think they retail 200 and something dollars and they were on sale for 75. Like I said, I thought they were cute on the website, but I don't know. They remind me of the Tevas, right? Just like the Tevas. I like the coloring, but I don't like the frayed. 
it's not giving me what I thought it was gonna give. So they're going back. Like I said, I never heard of this brand before. All right, I'm about to end the vlog here because I still have to edit this vlog and I plan on recording a video over on my other channel, my Disney channel. Check that out if you haven't already. I'm be doing a giveaway over there and that video, that video is basically gonna be a lounge fly backpack haul. I purchased a couple new backpacks, Disney backpacks, so. I'm gonna do a little haul. Like I said, I'm also gonna do a giveaway. Thanks for watching and I hope y'all are okay with what I said earlier as far as where uh, the channel is going to be going. I mean, of course I'm gonna still do vlogs. I wanted to kind of branch out and do content videos where I may do unboxing of shoes, purses I get in, hauls. My first video, my first ever video on YouTube was an Ulta haul. So I used to shop at Ulta all the time. I used to watch haul videos all the time. So I'm like, I'm always shopping. <laughs> Why don't I get on here and do a haul myself? And then I started doing the family vlogs because I watch family vlogs all the time. My first ever family that I started watching was smart mom 1981 that was her name back then brandis now her channel name is just smart mom she was one of the first family vloggers that i started watching she honestly inspired me to start vlogging my life all right i'm gonna let y'all go because i'll be here forever always remember be you do you for you